Good afternoon, Pats fans, and welcome inside the Brant Center as we preview tonight's action between the Regina Pats and the visiting Kamloops Blazers on the final home weekend of the pre-Christmas schedule. My name is Dante DeCarry, and he's Drew Posty, and it's the Regina Pats coming off a huge 6-5 shootout victory over the Swift Kern Broncos on Saturday night in which the Pats have now won their fourth consecutive Teddy Bear Toss game. Sam Maremba scoring that Teddy Bear Toss goal as part of a three-point performance, and Tanner Howe with the shootout winner. Yeah, that's exactly what the doctor ordered for the Regina Pats. We've talked about the success that they've had on home ice uh, this season uh, here at the Brand Center and uh, that's going to need to continue this weekend because you got two games at home and then five on the road heading into the uh, holiday break. So uh, the home ice uh, importance just continues for the Regina Pats. It starts tonight. Yeah, that's right, Drew. Nine victories on home ice for the Regina Pats. We'll see how they fare tonight against the Kamloops Blazers. Let's talk a little bit about Sam Aremba. He's maybe one of our spotlight players for tonight's hockey game. Three points on Saturday, a career-high three-point game as well as the teddy bear toss goal no better way to get going if you're samaremba than what you had on saturday yeah you love to see a regina guy score that goal as well too and i don't want to call sam a streaky score but maybe that's a little bit of the the tendency that he's had this year but when he's going he really can put up some numbers he can be a point of game player and he's one of those guys we keep saying he's going to break out he's going to break out if he can string together a couple of games like he's had then uh, hey look out yeah, and Ty Spencer also snapped a 15-game goalless drought with a goal on Saturday night. Parker Berg scored his seventh of the season. He's still up there amongst all Western Hockey League defensemen in goals and in points this season. So a couple of other players to keep your eye out for. Let's talk a little bit about the Kamloops Blazers. They've lost their last two games coming in. They currently rank dead last in the Western Conference, 21st overall in the Western Hockey League. And again, they're coming off a couple of losses to the Victoria Royals. Thoughts on the Blazers coming into town tonight? Well, we know they're a hockey club that's looking ahead to the future but uh, hey they've got uh, quite a few guys on that team that already have over 20 points so they do have some offensive threats on that team and uh, you know you can't take any team lightly and I know the Pats know that. Drew they also have a lot of experience on the roster in terms of guys that were playing for last year's Memorial Cup team in which did fall short and they had 103 points last year so this is still a pretty good Camels Blazers club. Yeah obviously they were going for it all last year being the host team of the Memorial Cup and uh, some of those experienced players and those star players are gone but hey, those guys that were uh, some of the younger guys and some of the uh, depth players last year, they experienced that. And uh, that's valuable experience to have. And, uh, you know, that can only uh, boost your confidence and make you a better player going forward. Yeah, these two clubs have not played each other for quite some time. In fact, the last time that the Regina Pats played the Kamloops Blazers here inside the Brand Center, Drew, was December 11, 2019. And it was the Blazers defeating the Regina Pats 4-2 in that contest back in the 1920 season. So uh, Pats fans have not had the opportunity to see the Kamloops Blazers in quite some time here in the Queen City. One reminder for tonight's hockey game is if you're interested, come to the Brand Center early as the first 1,500 fans into the building will receive a free calendar. That's right. Ahead of the new year, we are offering a free calendar for you with Pats players throughout. So make sure to come to the Brand Center early to have a chance to get a free calendar ahead of uh, the 2024 year. So that's exciting. And if you're also interested, put your name in for a raffle as uh, the Regina Pats will be raffling off Tanner Howe's game used jersey signed from the 2022 23 season. Uh, make your way onto the concourse all the way to where the near the subway is to have an opportunity to partake in that activity. It's the Regina Pats getting ready to take on the Kamloops Blazers. Make sure to get your tickets online at reginapats.com. Doors open at 6, puck drops at 7 o'clock. We'll see you tonight.